It's time for a season kickoff edition of Tweets of the Week. And we start with the biggest news of the week, some sad news for Colts fans. Peyton Manning out for a long time. Now, before we found out about his surgery, Colts owner Jimmy Irsay, who we all know is a very avid tweeter, tweeted this about the opening of the NFL season. It's almost like Jim was saying, hey guys, NFL season's starting, get so excited. Oh, by the way, the face of your franchise is gonna be out for a while, but forget about that, it's time for the season. And one of our favorite tweeters here at Pro Football Weekly, Eric Stengel, having a little fun with Jim Irsay, because again, Jim does time, tend to tweet some odd music lyrics. And this one we actually understood, Peyton Manning will be out for a while. Moving to the Saints-Packers opening game, everyone noticed the touchback situation. There were eight touchbacks in the first game. Last year's first game of the season, just one, because of the new kickoff rule this year. Bears safety Chris Harris wanted to know if the touchback now, because it happens all the time, is most exciting playing football. Not. Josh Cribbs, who is a kickoff returner, as we know, he had sounded off a little bit on the way he feels about the new kickoff rule, and actually what Josh Cribbs is alluding to might happen one day. We conclude Tweets of the Week with safety Gerald Alexander, who thought when he was watching that wild Saints-Packers game, man, I really wish Gus Johnson was on the call. Don't we all, Gerald? Can you just imagine watching last night's exciting game with Gus Johnson on the call? Probably would have had to turn your volume down. It would have been pretty entertaining. When you're watching week one of the NFL season this Sunday, be sure to follow us on Twitter at Pro Football Weekly and check out all our analysis at ProFootballWeekly.com.